Hello YouTube, um, today I'm going to be uh, discussing another Raspberry Pi video and today the topic is going to be Open Source Media Center, formerly known as Raspberry as RasBMC. Uh, it's a totally different feel, but it doesn't have to be. Uh, this is the uh, main screen. Uh, it's completely different. In fact, it's kind of confusing. So I'm going to teach you how to change the skin. Uh, I'll also uh, walk you through a little bit if you want to stay on this screen. It's a big change to get used to. Uh, so basically your videos, your add-ons will be here if you'd like. Uh, I have Genesis and such. Um, your programs. Same spot. Uh, it's really just a different feel. It's all still there. The one thing that I don't like though is how to add uh, files. It's uh, quite a different feel. I don't care for it. Um, uh, but we can change that. If you go to settings, go to appearance, you can select the default confluence which is the default skin for Cody so if we go ahead and click it you'll see that confluence is right there just click it in there you go you have confluence now uh, I'm gonna teach you how to go through some of the settings first so we'll just click no quickly it'll change back I think here we go. Now, from the main screen, you might want to have you might want to get to the settings, the default like like under programs where it used to say RasBMC settings. We're going to go there. Now, this is a really different feel. So, we'll go ahead and click it out into programs. Now, OSMC settings. Look, see? So here is the totally different feel. So you have your updates, your services, your overclocking. So if you choose that you that you may want more power, you can choose that. And they have a store. And most importantly the network. So configure the network if you if you didn't do that in the um, uh, first video to go manually you'll want to have wireless enabled adapter uh, enable adapter you want to have this white box um, if it's not if you don't have a white box go up there like that see Oh, it's, there, that's off. That's on. So, now you have it enabled. Now you can go down to wireless. And it'll look for the connections. Which is there. Now remotes, you can, you have your standard remotes. I think this is so that you can, um, if you have remotes, I think it can be programmed in. I'm not sure though. Um, it's a totally different feel. Uh, personally, I don't care for it just because it's too big of a change for me. Um, I personally uh, like the skin App TV. It's a skin that's supposed to look like Apple TV. I'll show you. See? It's just like Apple TV. Uh, this is my favorite one, but that doesn't mean you have to like it. There's tons of other uh, skins. But uh, that'll be a topic for a different time. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, if you liked 
the video, please subscribe, hit the like button. Uh, thank you for watching, and I hope you learned a little bit about uh, or uh, enjoyed the partial review on Open Source Media Center and uh, how to change the skins. Um, that's about it. Uh, thanks for watching.